Moving up to our mod one here, I'm going to set up a few destinations here. Um, so I'm going to select mod one as a source. And then what I want to do here is I want to bring in the filter because I want it to open up over time. Oh, hold on, in just a minute, another source, knock that off. So I need a target of a filter one. Okay. And then the next thing I'm going to go to the dry wet on the reverb which you can see there we go reverb dry wet and maybe what I might do here is actually the decay time on the amplitude envelope so let's jump in here so we'll go amp one decay okay and then Let's just see what happens here. So I'm going to turn these up all the way just for now. So I'm actually, I want to hit the MIDI learn here for a second. Okay, so there we go. So let's hear what this sounds like. So I'm using this one mod to actually control these few different functions here over time, which I think is going to add a lot to the sound, create that real tension sort of builder. So let's see what this sounds like. Okay, so I've just made a couple of adjustments there, which is going to be the reverb is actually going too much on there. I think we would actually have to bring up the decay time of that reverb as well. So let's go back in here, reverb, decay time. So maybe not have it as much. Again, this is just going to be tweaking up these parameters to get them to sit right over time. So Let's see what this sounds like. So just leave it for the first few bars, like this, and then start to bring it in gradually. Okay, quite nice. Let's bring up that decay a little more. Let's just see quickly what this sounds like with the decay up. Just want to create a little bit more of a bigger space. Yeah, I think that's going to do the trick. 